right, guys, a, another quick tactic for you. We're going to talk about approach and game plan late game in order to win a game. And I'm not going to win. You're going to see a mistake, but we're going to talk about it. I talk about this quite a bit, actually, the approach. We're here on Wide Park. How, where you drive, how much of your tank you expose, how you push into where you expect the guys to be de defending from is very important. A lot of it has to do with map knowledge as well. So we're on Wide Park. We're trying to hunt down this T-67. He was last spotted up here. I'll tell you that I came all the way across the north of the map here. It came south down the west side across the tracks. So I've cleared all of that. I know he's not here, and I know he's not here. Just take a look at it. It's Wide Park. Where do you think a T-67 with 34,000-something games, this is what this guy has. It's something like that, 24,000, I don't remember. It's tens of thousands of games in the T-67. He's taking on two guys. Where do you think he is? Well absolutely he's down here in the southeast corner on the hill in a bush and even if he can't quite spot the cap from where he is he can shift around a little bit and get a shot so i don't feel especially with my 184 hit points like i am able to jump on the cap and survive he's probably going to come out spot me might even out spot me depending on where he is and what bush he uses so my plan is to try to sneak up onto that hill but i make a, a critical error here so far so good i've been able to come across the west side here, there were a couple openings I didn't get spotted in. Well, what does that tell me? It tells me he's probably not in the buildings right here, right? As I cross this opening here and the opening to the south, if he was hiding in a bush or behind, or in and amongst all these buildings over here, these like factory kind of things, more than likely I get lit or die because he shoots me, but nothing happens. So now I am even more convinced he's up here in the southeast. And if I had this had to do this again, I would not approach this way. Let's talk about the approach that I take, though. I'm going to come around the back. I will say, initially, I was hoping to maybe catch him hiding out back here. Well, how good is this guy, really? So we come on up here, and boom, let's stop. All right, so if I had been paying closer attention to the rings, you can see the green and the white ring are now well past the position where that guy is so even somebody with pretty bad view range is is now able to kind of see me i should have come around this corner till the white ring got to the edge there and paused for a second maybe even tucked up against the building creep forward back forward back forward back i do have a time problem i only have 51 seconds but if i kind of forward back forward back i might have been able to save myself from this fate right here as i'm like oh crap i'm lit let's just shoot into there and hope it helps and we'll try to get out shoot again Oh, crap, I took it. The two shots, again, were a mistake. I should have backed out of this. Back, 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 back. All right, now, what would I, what would I uh, do if I had it to do again? Because I passed these openings, and I was pretty sure that he wasn't in the factories, I should have come on the left side of this row, come up across here, try to avoid going over the cap so he doesn't know I'm here. So right along this edge here, Sneak up into this area and now do some peeking and poking and see if I can't get even closer to where he might be up there. So, unfortunately, and I don't back out. So now I'm just kind of like, oh, please don't kill me. But he ends up getting two shots uh, with his APCR and takes me out. Now, I knew I had one shot to give based on the alpha on the T-67. But I just went in too deep. I was a little bit careless or a lot of bit careless right there. But your approach matters. So try to use as much cover as you can when you're approaching these camping TDs and guys hiding in bushes using a little bit of map knowledge. Once again, I didn't get spotted crossing over here. There was no reason why I couldn't have come up here on the left side of these buildings right up to this here and take a peek. Now, if he doesn't get lit, then you have to take a chance, right? But at least I was a little bit closer and might have been able to find that guy. So there you go. Quick tactic. tactic. Tactics talk on correct approaches and things to think about late game when you're trying to dig people out. Try not to give them long lines of sight like this guy had.